Hey guys, here's the shopping haul I just went and got for the Easter baskets for the needy. I'm going to show you our shopping when we went to go get them in just a minute here, but there's a little clip I want to throw in because there's something significant that happened yesterday and today, and I want to share that with you, and it's a guy named Dale and why he's so special and significant. I'm going to throw that clip in right now, so go check that hey out. Hey guys, we'll I right wanted back. to get a little video of this. Um... I'm inside because I don't want him to see me and I don't want to get his face on film but we heard some our, our lawn being mowed I was like what is going on and um, there's my daughter's friend bringing back Nichelle and her dad because her dad went to go pick up the insurance check to get our hopefully another car soon and this guy was mowing our yard well um, I was I was like uh, hi and um he's anyway i found out he lived down the street he's the new guy and he just wanted to mow our lawn because as you see it's really overgrown i don't know if you can tell but he wanted to do something nice for somebody that he thought that needed it and he just couldn't have come in a better time and we really really needed it you guys don't even know we couldn't even afford to have our lawn care done our mowers broke it's just like everything is like totally messed up and i couldn't be more grateful right now <laughs> And I wanted to share that with you. Hubby's just now finding out because I called him and told him and now he's probably thanking him too. And it's just beautiful to see people helping other people and I'm sorry I'm crying right now but it just made me emotional because this is so nice. And um, we truly appreciate it I want, when people like do things for other people. And this is another reason why we love and care so much about helping other people because you never know when someone needs it like right now you know all right guys I just wanted to share this little clip and um also you know share it with you and hopefully inspire you what we do inspires you to help others as well because you know that's another reason why we do what we do and share it um in hopes to inspire others to help people and you know if you can't help many people it doesn't matter how many even if you can just help one with anything it doesn't matter he's doing this and it probably costs him nothing little bit of mower gas so I hope you have a good day I'm gonna go talk to hubby and um, enjoy the rest of this video all right I need you guys to go smash that like button for Dale He's out here again today, finishing our lawn for us. It's so sweet of him. I am just so grateful. And, you know, I really, I just don't know what to say. Um, but I, I wanted to show you guys again, because he's out here today. And I'm getting ready to go take a ride to the store. I'm getting a ride to go pick up the Easter stuff. So I wanted to share that with you guys and um, tell you about him again. I found out his name was Dale. Such a nice guy and they just moved in a couple of months ago down the street. All right guys, we're here at Walmart. We're ch trying to find some stuff for the Easter baskets we're gonna give away to the needy. With the pails that we found, um, I'm hoping they have what I'm looking for. I'm looking for like little Easter bags because a lot of the candy we found is not Easter themed. So we want to put it in some Easter themed bags and get some grass and see if we can't find some non-candy item that's inexpensive that I can buy enough that it will um, work in every bag yeah, or in every pail. Yeah, enough to spread to every person. Um, trying to help and not spend a ton at the same time. <laughs> right. We got all kind of stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna, they're gonna tell me I can't record here in Walmart, so I'm gonna try to hide the camera. Um, oh, we got lots of eggs. That's what I wanna get, eggs. I might have to go to the other aisle for that. You guys, I'm not seeing anything here but lots and lots of candy. Lots of it. Oh, look at these, guys. They would be so cute. Oh, check out these. Those are cute. Bunnies, Which ones? Reese's Cup bunnies. Oh, oh wait, Reese's Cup bunny. Oh, look at the bunny. I saw another Reese's Cup bunny somewhere the other day. Where did I see it? They got the Reese's Cup eggs. 
Because Michelle likes Reese Cub. It's funny, those bunnies always look really cool. These look ones. At the, it smells like fart down the side. Does it smell like fart to you? Yeah. Did you yeah. fart? No, I think the old guy did. Oh. Hey, these always look cool, but they always taste like crap. Oh, yeah. Yeah, crap. When I was a kid, these were my favorite right here. But I think they changed the recipe over the years, and I and at I'm one point, anymore. yeah, at one point I stopped enjoying them. These are super cute. If I had enough, I'd love to put one of these in every basket. That's a huge box. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that one-handed. We'll leave yeah, that there. The fun dip boxes. Oh, yeah. Hey, this would be a good buy. There's 24. No, I already got enough candy. All right, that's not going to work. <laughs> We got enough candy, Angie. <laughs> See, you guys, this is just candy. I'm not seeing the bags and the non-food items. I think we're going to have to go to... Yeah, we want other stuff besides candy. candy. Yeah, I'm just not seeing what we're looking for. We might have to go to the other aisle. There's no non-food items here. Whoa. What is that? Oh, they're an egg. Okay. Okay. I am not seeing anything that I want here. This is only candy. Yeah. Check that out. That's cute. It's kind of big. Um, yeah, these are all like the little individual things. That would cost a lot to do that. Alright, so we are going to go to the other aisle. So I usually don't see a clearance aisle at our Walmart, but we just walked past one. And I'm like, oh, let's go check it out. So I wanted to show you guys while we checked it out. Boy, that seems kind of pricey. $9 for that little mini cutting board? I don't know. I think that should be cheaper. That seems kind of expensive too. Four bucks. There's a faucet for what? Oh, for outdoor. But it's foam. 75 cents? That should be regular price. Anyway, let's uh, see what they got here. I need new dishes, so. Oh, I'm not paying $3.50. I am so cheap, you guys. You don't even know. Or oh, 150. Nope. I'm not gonna pay 150 either. Oh, look at that. 25 bucks. That's cute. You want one of these? No. I don't. That's probably not even clearance. Let's see. Even the bowls are still three dollars. What the heck? Look. Come on, Walmart. We can do better. This is right. a coffee mug. How much does that say? Four ninety-seven, seven dollars. <laughs> <laughs> How does that beers. work out? <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty cool. Check it out. Is that really a clearance item with seven dollars instead of four dollars? That's kind of cool. I'm not seeing anything that says you need this right now. Let's get this. What is that? We don't need that. We cook buns and hot dogs. <laughs> but only you eat hot dogs. That's cool though. Well, save up your money. You get that. <laughs> <laughs> How about some Wonder Arms? You want some Wonder Arms? Uh, no. That's pretty interesting, though. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I'm not seeing anything oil filter? really cool. Look at the cute little minions. Need oil filter? Walmart's got the hookup. P why would you want peelable <laughs> primer? It's not supposed to peel out. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, let's check out the, oh, look at this. I was gonna say, let's check out the candles, but check this out. These are pretty. I don't like the watch, but I like the bangles. Classic sheeting. Pretty, pretty. Oh, they got the makeup. Skincare, fidget spinners. What's the clearance price? Don't tell me they are this. What is it? There's no clearance price, but I'm curious of what they are. There's no way it's five because these are normally five. I'd probably have to scan it, but I don't want to. I was just curious. Ooh, silverware. Oh, no. I usually pay buy the four pack for a buck, so we're not going to get that. Yankee candles, nine bucks. That's not bad. Oh, even the bigger ones are, too. Okay. I think these should be less though, because the little one's nine dollars and so is the big one. Five for the little tiny one? I don't know. No, I'm not gonna buy it. Alright guys, let's get to the Easter thing. I think I want to get some eggs for the baskets. So I'll get one of these. Alright. 
All right, guys, we are in the other section. These are some multi-packs. I'm hoping I can find some multi-packs of stuff, maybe, of a non-food item. Over here's the stuffed animals. Um, I might have to go to the dollar store to get a stuffed animal because I wanted to get one stuffed animal for every basket. And these are $2.98 a piece, so I'm not going to do that. That's just too much. Oh, Michael found bags. Okay. How many is in each? Oh, 15, so I'm still going to have to get two. Are you serious? I one of each, so I know what you wanted. I'll come over there and see what else they got. I don't know which one, you guys. Uh, maybe the ducks. That seemed more... Let's do ducks. That seems more like both themed. Where are these at? Okay. We'll get a second duck. I can't believe there's only 15. That's an extra dollar I gotta spend. And I didn't want to spend. That we could have saved. So, we try to try to make this, you know stretch as far as we can so oh they do have little dollar stuffed animals but they're not that cute but they are one dollar they're actually a couple cents cheaper i think i'll get them here you want to help me pick out oh cool you want to help me pick out um let's see one two three we gotta do 16. four Five. Look at the bunny. Wait, I don't think this bunny's included. No, the bunny's not included. Pay attention to the tag. How many do I have there now? Here. Eight, nine. A little, little froggy. You got another one that's ten. Eleven, twelve. Um... 13 I don't know how many to get 14 15 Oh, I wish there was more of these 16 Let's see if we can find more white bunnies Here, swap that out with something else Sorry if I'm breathing in the camera, guys Here's another white bunny Another one All right, here's two more. Just don't swap them out with the green, the green um, things. All right, so we have 16? Okay. See, I wanted to find like, maybe a big pack like this, but I don't know. Maybe I'll just do the baggies. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna do the eggs and then take some of the candy and put it in the baggies and then do the stuffed animals. So we got one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and we'll count one more when I get up there. I think that's the most economical way to do it. I wanted to put another Easter themed item that didn't cost a lot, but I honestly don't know what to get. Like I wanted to do like notepads, but honestly I don't I don't see anything like that. These are little books, but I don't know that they're all gonna be little kids to get them. And, and this is only one book. I wanted to be like, you know, like sometimes you can find those four packs of notepads. That's what I was hoping to find. How many 3D, 29 pieces? What is this? Six game tablets? Oh, six. So how many? One, two, three. Six and six is twelve. Plus one more. Three different ones. Yeah. Okay, so I think we might do these guys. Good find, Mike. All right, so we're gonna add these to our pile. What else did you find? Anything else? The pencils. Pencils? I don't know. This is an activity pad, but you only get one. Oh, I wish they had ones that were more either or, boy or girl. No, I'm going to shy away from the pencils. Anything else? Hmm. This is really hard. This is not as easy as I thought it would be. I thought we were just going to come in here and we would find some stuff really quick. We got two packs of yo-yos. 
Here are these down here. There's some packs. I think that I should just stick with what I got. Do you think I should get the name pads or nah? The, t t the pads we got? Nah? Just stick with the stuffed animals and the egg with candy in it and then the bags. You can do a little game thing if you want to. No, because you know how kids are now. Days, they don't care about that kind of stuff. You know what, guys? I'm having a change of heart. <laughs> I think we're going to just put these back and stick with the eggs and the stuffed animals. Because kids nowadays just, you know, Video game. this might be a waste of money here. And I want to get the most for my money. And I don't think I'm going to find it. I wish I would have found a bunch of these in four packs. Little notepads. Alright, guys. I think that is it. That's all we're going to get today. We'll go check out the other aisle just to see if we missed anything. But I wish we found a better Easter bag. Funny faces? No, I didn't like those. I did see them though. Them Easter all. grass, that's what we need. Let's see them all silly Easter. No. Let's see, how much Easter grass are we gonna need? 38 cents. I'm gonna use like one Easter grass for every two baskets. So. Why don't you just get a bigger bag? One ounce. Alright, so. We have 16 pails, and I'm going to use one of these for every two pails. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think I'm going to do all green and just keep it. Grass looking. Yep. All right, I'm glad I came down this aisle because I would have forgotten what I wanted to get. No, I think those are good. There's enough to do everything. Which is the important part. All right, there's nothing down here. I think we should, what? There's 16 of them? There's like 20 some. Yeah. I wish there was other Easter bag options. I could save $1 if they just had one more bag in them. See, here's the other eggs. These are too small. Well, there's some more bags over here, guys. Hold on. $10, 250 eggs. No way. Oh, look at this, guys. What treat you, bags. What would you do with 20 treat bags. What would you do with 250 eggs? I don't know, but we just saved a dollar. Ooh, ooh. Okay, I'm just going to get this one. I think that one looks the best. Or, hmm, how about, no, that one's, that one costs more. What's Perfect. This? This now we're going to dig out the other ones. These are cute, but there's 20 in this. And there's only 15 in this, so it's better for me to do that, and I can save a buck. I don't want one egg. No, <laughs> look at Mike's egg. All right. Got more on those, didn't we? No, 97 cents. <laughs> See, Mike, Mike, 97 cents. Mm -hmm. It says there's more eggs inside this egg. Hmm. All right, I think that's it. We are, I think we're officially out of here. And I might not have to go to the Dollar Tree for anything. I think I got everything I wanted. Unless you could think of something else. Mm -hmm. What? We'll get you something? <laughs> no, we're good. Alright guys, mm -hmm. we're about to head out of here because I had to get some groceries too. For me and the kids. And, um, um... Yeah, I'm sure you guys already heard about the car. Well, by the time you see this video, I don't know if we will have updated you by then or not. So, we have already gotten updated on something. So, all right. All right, we're out of here and headed home. All right, so now on to the haul. Also, a big shout out to those who donated for this cause. We truly, truly appreciate that. And you really helped us to make this possible. And I'm really excited to do it. And these donations, when we're doing things like this, really do help to put things together and for us to make things, you know, better than what they were. Whether, you know, whether it be a little grass or candy or, you know, the stuffed animals. Those donations really help to, they're going to help to make these baskets a little nicer and really help brighten the kids' days who otherwise would not have had an Easter basket. Alright, so what we got, ended up getting for the Easter baskets after donations is, well, here's the Easter baskets. We got 16 of those, which you guys already know about, but I wanted to show them again. And then, well, that's what we're using for the Easter baskets. And then we, I ended up picking up these uh, treat bags, so to give them a more of an Easter feel. And what I'm going to do is put some of the candy in here and then tie them up and put them in the pail. 
And then I also got a bag of eggs. It's a 24 count. Um, these are nice size. I can put some candy in them and then use the leftover for Junior. Then I got eight bags of Easter grass. I'm going to show you these. That was cool. These I'm going to put two. I'm going to take one bag and then split it between every two pails. Four, five, six, seven, and then eight. And then lastly, we got stuffed animals. This is my favorite part here. Let's move the piece of grass out of the way. And then for the stuffed animals, we got 16 of these. There's a little bunny. And then we got, I think he's a donkey. Yeah, how cute. And then we got little frogs and more little bunnies. We got white ones and pink ones. Then we got little piggies and little bunnies that lay down. These are blue, how cute. Another little froggy, another white bunny, a pink bunny, another gray donkey. Oh, um, a little gray bunny, a white bunny, another white bunny. I tried to get as many bunnies as we could. Another white bunny. Oh, and uh, a blue bunny. Um, this one's standing up, and then the other blue bunny is laying down. And lastly, another frog. Those are so freaking cute. I really hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I cannot wait to make these baskets and give them away to the needy for Christmas, or for, yeah, for Christmas, geez, for Easter. This is going to be so much fun. I really enjoy doing things like this, and... Um, I hope by sharing these experiences and things that we enjoy doing like this on our channel that it inspires others to do the same because that's what I want you to take away from these types of videos. If you think that we're doing this for views, then I prefer you not watch our channel and unsubscribe because that's the last thing we're doing. What I want is to inspire others and if we can use our platform to help people in need, that's what I want to do is to use this platform to do just that. All right, guys, I hope you have a beautiful day. I hope you enjoyed this video and look for the next one because in the next one we'll be um, making the baskets. All right, guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.